just 18 years old, taken from here by a drunk driver. She's missed. Aspen Blessing's family seeing through the tears the unimaginable grief. She did what she was put here on earth to do is love people. With the mission that Aspen's life may just save others. In Baird, one family's loss is being felt by the entire community. The family of Aspen Blessing dedicating a memorial sign on I-20 to honor her life. The hope is that the sign will serve as a reminder to not drink and drive. K-Texas reporter Brenna Gibbons has more with Aspen's family. So Aspen was the greatest light. Um, she was such a joy to be around. She loved everyone and every animal. Um, she wouldn't walk into a room without making somebody's day feel better. She loved including everyone and, and what she was doing. Um, she loved celebrating everything, every season, every life. Um, and she just, she carried the joy of the Lord everywhere she went. On March 10th, 2024, Aspen Blessing's life was taken by a drunk driver at only 18 years old. There is now a sign on I-20 between FM 603 and Buck Creek Road in the exact spot her car was found after the accident to help remind people to pay attention and not drink and drive. For us, it's a, just a physical reminder um, to people of what we're hoping comes out of the situation. It's also just a reminder of how many lives can be impacted by one decision. And so through this all, we've, um, you know, the first responders, the uh, just everybody involved, the ripple effect that it's had on people. And we're hoping that, you know, if we can change one life, change one decision to where no other family has to go through this, um, that that can, that good can come out of this situation. In 2023, there were over 23,000 alcohol-related traffic crashes. 236 of them were in the Abilene District. The Blessing family partnered with TxDOT to help spread awareness of how many lives can be affected by just one choice. Taking her vehicle into schools, being able to share her story, trying to impact these younger people, um, younger generations about how their one choice does matter, whether that be driving or in some other aspect of life. Um, and so the website is just there to, to share her story and to bring awareness to what we have going. Yeah, just a place where people can come and see, see a different view from a tragedy that is normally just bad. Uh, we, wanna, we wanna show people that good can come from really hard things. Aspen's family says they miss her and they're proud of who she was. She did a good job. Um, her life really left a huge impact. Um, yeah, she's missed, but um, she did. She did what she was put here on earth to do is love people and love them well. And we've got it from here and we'll continue to honor and carry her memory and continue to love people. In Callahan County, I'm Brenna Gibbons. K-Texas News.